The interview took place a day after the IS claimed control over the millennia-old oasis city. Abdul Karim blamed the IS entry into the ancient city on international inaction. We look forward to the international community shouldering its responsibility towards Syrian cultural heritage. The heritage is now threatened by armed terrorist groups and IS. Terrorists are attacking and plundering artifacts and historic monuments. They are not only destroying Christian and atheist monuments, but Islamic tombs as well. Abdul Karim said that government forces had managed to transfer all transportable ancient items from Palmyra to a safe area, and expressed grave concern over the fate of the old temples and monuments that cannot be moved. IS knows very well that it couldn't enter the city of Palmyra if there was true international will to stop IS, as they would have never succeeded in entering this historic city. However, it's really unfortunate that IS moves freely in the Syrian desert with the whole world watching. Palmyra is not just a Syrian city, but a global one. He also urged the international community to intervene because it's not the battle of the Syrian army alone, but it's the battle of all Syrians. Palmyra, a UNESCO World Heritage Site, contains monumental ruins of a city which was one of the most important cultural centers in ancient times.